think about CIOS in terms of your wallet and a key ring that you might have. So in your wallet, you have bank cards, you have loyalty cards, you have your building access card. And on your key ring, you have a brass key that might fit your home or your automobile. So think about CIOS as being a complete ecosystem that helps you move those cards from your wallet and the keys from your brass key ring into an NFC-enabled smartphone and then being able to use that smartphone to open doors just like you did with either cards or keys. There's three things that make CIOS unique and revolutionary. First of all, it's the world's first commercial ecosystem for issuing, delivering, and revoking digital keys to NFC-enabled smartphones. Second, we were able to develop CIOS from the ground up, meaning that we were able to develop it specifically for mobile phone use and also to be smartphone independent. So whatever smartphone you have, you can run it on. And I think the third thing that makes it unique is that we thought a lot about building in security, privacy, and a rich user interface so that users would have the best possible experience in using that phone. So when we think about and talk about the CEOS ecosystem, we're talking about what I like to call the nuts and bolts, or three separate components. So first of all, we're talking about handsets. So we're talking about the actual smartphone itself that needs to be CEOS enabled. The second piece that we're talking about is the hardware. So there we talk about the readers, uh, we talk about electromechanical locks, and we also talk about third-party hardware that will be CIOS enabled with our technology inside. The third piece of the ecosystem that we do make is our IDTSM. So that's one of our delivery mechanisms in order to deliver those digital keys from our key vaults into the customer's phone. The other parts and pieces of the ecosystem are made up of mobile network operators, so the carriers who provide the cell phone service. It's made up of the chip providers, the people who put the NFC-enabled chips inside of the handsets. It's the actual handset providers that we work with in order to be able to put our app or our application onto the handset. Uh, so it's everything that goes around making it a seamless environment.